Is India starts in 15 minutes and concludes tomorrow on BBC Two. Toy. <laughs> let's have a look at it in this light, Mitch, because there's... It's Top Toy. And this yeah. is where Chris works. What, what, well, what have we got I here? wish I knew. What does that one do? That looks like a gear stick on a sort of Ford Capri circa 1970. <laughs> <laughs> and Paul's still mucking about oh, with something. Nick. Oh, it's Nick! Nickers! Now we're going to go film Nickers! This boy is one of look. 55 million child. It's Nick! That's what you look like on the telly. Oh, wow. Glad I washed my hair this morning. And tell me what you're doing. Nickers Knockers, we're going to go and record this promo. And Ellen's panicky because she's got uh, to do it by 12.30. Yeah. She's got to be away, and it's now 12.26. Gotcha. But I don't really care, because everything always takes forever. And that's the way it goes. Now, don't film lots of me, because that'll be really boring to watch back. You can press the pause button, Nickers. In fact, I wish you would press the pause button, please. I know, it's horrible being filmed, isn't it? Yes. Emergen so, emergency on flight 483. Who's going to talk or pose for a photo? Getting the story. Airport 8.30 on BBC One. Haven't you pressed pause yet? That's him giving me direction, which I ignore. OK. Emergency on flight 483. Who's going to talk? Or pose for a photo. Getting the story. Airport, Thursday 8.30 on BBC One. Emergency on flight 483. No injuries at all, uh, so they're here somewhere, so we've got to find them. Who's going to talk? Walk me through your mind at the time. Is, is this thing going to explode? Paul pose for a photo. She's pretty, she's blonde, she was on the flight, she might give us a nice graphic account. Excuse me, could you tell us what happened? Whenever anything happens, you stop the press, seems to be the first priority. Go away. Getting the story. Airport, Thursday, 8.30 on BBC One. This remote control unit that I found next door is bigger, about four times as big as the whole bloody camera you're filming this on. Look at that. Getting the store. I'm going out now. Left. Left, 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 left. Where? Yeah. 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 Where are we going to go? Where are we going to go? Left. Left, it's that way. Because when you work at the BBC, you can work here for a million years and you still find Lots of new areas that you never knew existed. And this is another area I've never been in before in my life. Come on, come on. I'm the sorry of a dead person on the wall. <laughs> Are we still rolling? I'm going this way. Filming. He likes holding long shots, doesn't he, Nick? I would have turned it off. Track, about track, half track, 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 We've gone round in a circle. And we're looking for multi-format area. Production, multi-format area, FPP apparatus room, cassette replay That's area. it. Oh, that's going here. Ooh, look. Oh, Press buttons. Wow, Nickers knows everything. Look. No, Lots of equipment. There she is. What? A DBC Pro, look. Woohoo! Turn it on, turn it on. No, you mustn't. Why not? Come on. Look at this. The BBC have got everything. This is an old Philips domestic home video recorder. Do you remember Betamax? This was before Betamax. This was the old... Oh, look, here's a cassette! Oh. Look at the state of that. Hold that for the camera, Nickers. That's, that was one of the first video grammars in the world, wasn't it? Then, jumper generation. That's a Betamax, which was actually better quality than... It was good. I've got an old beta tape from me when I was at school. Very good. There's video 8. No, video high 8, sorry. 
What's this one, Nickers Knockers? Uh, that is Umatic. Umatic, that's a VHS, I recognise that one. This is a super VHS, so many formats. Yeah. This is our baby, because this is what we want to use. That is one. DV. But as Nick says, why do they hide the adapters? And so people do make porno films at the BBC. No! <laughs> uh, no, they don't. Can you pixelate my face? Now we found another room, this is Telly Cine. So many things are the size of these machines! This is 35mm, isn't it? I used to work on them. And, game. quick gate blast. What's that? Oh, that's when you get hair in the gate. When you're making porno films. Can no! Got to do it again. Can I do it again? Yeah. Gate. Can we film this, please? One moment, caller. Gate blast. And then, watch the machine. That's fantastic. <laughs> OK, uh, this is audio. Yeah. I used to work on these machines in John Boy Studios in Soho. That's it. I used to have to loop it and do rock and roll. And that's your mag. Fuck, there's everything set, in here. Set mag. And of course, nobody uses these machines anymore because of cutbacks. <laughs> <laughs> because a programme prevention officer comes in, says, get out of the studio, go and be an accountant or something, and make programmes. <laughs> <laughs> and left. Ah, uh, this way. Just sitting in the door, then. Ah, hello, what's this? This is how it used to be. Yeah. This is the film recording area in the basement of TV centre. And there used to be people here, but the ratings reduction officer made sure that they all got fired. So, <laughs> so there's no one around anymore. <laughs> <laughs> What's in here? Uh, I don't know, isn't he? Oh, I don't know. Oh, no yeah. people. Oh, Ooh. people. Yeah. Call Meeting. security. There's some pro. Hang on. Meeting. Meeting. Hang on a minute. <laughs> security. There's some program makers in the building. Let <laughs> me <laughs> remove them, please. <laughs> BBC. Then you edit to DigiBeat. Uh, oh, sorry, sorry you, dubbed yeah, you dubbed it. You dubbed it. Could you do that again? <laughs> 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 well, no, so you dubbed and go. You dubbed it. Oh, you dubbed to another tape uh, or something. <laughs> it's called Ua. Uh, oh, what happened in your tent in Glastonbury very quickly? Um, it got very wet. <laughs> and someone had a poo on your tent, yes. didn't they? Uh, so the DVC, which is slightly longer, which is. Oh, yeah, I know what you mean. By the way, why does it say voice alarm in the corner? Well, if you don't do well, Mitch. <laughs> no, if you do well, it comes on. He's, he's been in us now. Pulse alarm. A bit sort of naughty. Mm. But in a way, it's not. It's, he's been in us now. Do you want extra for appearing in vision? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Well, you can't have it. Works for me. I do remember. Okay. <laughs> I do remember this one. Is that another gadget? Another gadget? Is that another yes. gadget? Oh, let's have a go with this! Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Press a bit. Oh, sorry. Oh, you guys the club for a beer? Yeah, have a drink, Mitch. I'd love to come, come for on, a beer. Walk this way. But my car runs out. Where's Chris coming? Your car runs out by itself. No. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to the club, Christopher? Um, well, maybe. Where are we going now, everybody? BT99. Ah, now this is the new extension. It looks like an airport, because everyone's always departing. No. <laughs> uh, keep going left, Mitch. Yeah, I think they'll do it, and I think the BBC have got a store somewhere. What you've got to do is, is find a sound format that needs them, and, and you know you have to use them on programmes then. That's what you need, isn't it, Paul? We can put them through a bunch of it. Put it on pause. I'll right, tell you again. Apparently you couldn't find a thermostat. Oh. So they went to look at some drawings. Oh, oh well, it'll take a week. Mitch's journey in the lift. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. And don't zoom, that's us. Give someone, give someone the BBC camera and fuck it up. <laughs> <laughs> We've been doing it for years. Pause!